Yours isn't on yet. Did you turn on the receiver? Yes, I did. Okay. And it's on now. Okay. Let's go. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy Friday. Uh, we have had a rather <laughs> interesting morning. Nah. With... Uh, Interesting questions from 14-year-olds oh on gosh. down to uh, on down to uh, going to the range and getting a few hundred rounds in uh, as practice. So Good news cool. is I actually hit the target today. So. She's doing actually really better, uh, much much better. Super super good news. She's gone from about half or less. No, about half. Her she averages about 50 percent. And um, she went up to 75% today. So she's doing good. She's <laughs> doing good. Ragged edge, 68. I'm literally stuck in my own hair. Stop. I can't get it out. Stop. Untwist it. I can't. You've got I, to be kidding you me. No, I'm, I'm stuck. I can't get Can you? Oh. What are you? What did you do? Oh my Ow. goodness gracious! Okay, okay, I can get it out now. I think no, nope. <laughs> ah, <sighs> look at that! <laughs> Come off the circulation. <laughs> Life with me is super interesting. Let me just say that. <laughs> mm. Oof. And the hits just keep on coming. <coughs> Hola, amigos. Nice to see you all. Get the scissors, Tom I, says. Literally, look how tight it was. I don't have that problem. You're not me, though. I have Jesse, that problem. Jesse, how did you do that? Right? I don't know. How? I was how? going like this. And right. And I got it, like, stuck. Like, I couldn't, but I couldn't untwist it, and I couldn't pull it out. It's not like your hand, your hair has hands. It Did can't grab you a hold saw of itself. how so. tight it was twisted. I know, but how? I don't know. That's the question. <laughs> we know what happened. We want to know how it happened. Because I'm Jesse. Oh my goodness gracious! Haven't played, but interested to see this one. We are listening on our drive down to whoop, steamers. Whoop, 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 whoop. Can't wait to see you guys. Good to have you. Sam made an amazing face. <laughs> Yeah, that happens he a lot. He makes this a lot. It started with this morning. And it, I know this isn't our Q&A, but I'm going to just start with this. That's fine. I said, would you like to hear the question of the day from the 14-year-old? This is before the sun's up, apparently. <laughs> and I said, his question was, can I keep the fan on while I take the shower? The fan being the exhaust fan. In the bathroom. That is built <laughs> to pull... The steam from the shower <laughs> out. And he asks, Can is I... it okay to run this fan while I take a shower? I think he usually runs it Bruh. after the shower. What difference does it make? <laughs> it doesn't make a difference. All I know. It's in the ceiling. All I know it's is not that getting that any was water his in. question. Oh, my heave. My goodness. All right, let's focus. We Anyhow. got a game to play. Anyhow. Oh my gosh. Matthew I did get my Vincent finger out of my hair now. Look at that. Hello. That was so tight. Ugh. Hola. That is unbelievable. Unbelievable. All right. So, welcome. This is Friday. And tomorrow, I do want to let you know right off the bat our live QA is going to be one hour earlier than normal. It's going to start at 8 o'clock Pacific time uh, in the morning. Uh, because I have to get the car, the Jeep, to uh, an oil change appointment at 11. So we'll have to end at about 10, 10.30 so I can get the, the car over there. So be ready for that. I haven't got it scheduled yet, but it it's coming. It's going to happen 8 o'clock in the morning, tomorrow, live Q&A as per usual. Now, we are taking a stab at this monstrosity. Now, the reason I wanted to show this box is because I, I think the size of this box so cool. is absolutely hilarious. It's 
it's like Arcane Wonders <laughs> looked at Gloomhaven and said, you guys think that. you guys got a big we box? We got you. We got you. Now, here's the thing. The sheer enormity of this box makes me chuckle every single time I see people <laughs> checking it out of a library at a convention. I've actually seen people carrying it. Here, take the other end. Like this. Like, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. one guy's walking backward to their table. And it's like, come on. But here's the thing. It's a huge box. But, oh my goodness. The sheer, the way I put it in the posts is eye candy. Board game eye candy oui. is exactly what this is. Now, this is so cool. You can't really see it much right now because I've got all my buildings over here and Jess has all of her buildings over there. And it's just, you know, a couple of flashy things, but man alive. At the end of the game, when you guys take a look at this, and we'll take some time, and I've got my uh, my iPhone ready so we can do some close-ups and stuff like that during the game and all that kind of thing to really show you the the level of detail that went into this. Now, this is JT's copy, and uh, he paid the extra, I don't know however much it was, to get the um, uh, ink job done on the, uh, uh, so that, you know, the, the ink settled into the recesses and it just makes all of those details pop a little That's bit so more. That's so cool. But it's amazing. Do you want to start with it? Because you said if you start with it, then it works better in the beginning. Well, we are, I already got it up there here. I'll go ahead and do this. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Board Game Bree is here. Bree Goldman from Arcane Wonders. Thank you for joining us, madam. I appreciate that. Um, okay, so I've got this going. Let me go ahead and just scooch over uh, to this screen so that you guys can see how freaking awesome these buildings are. And... I mean, the level of detail on these suckers is, I, I mean, it, it's speechless. I'm speechless. Models like this exist, and yeah, you got to pay for them, but goodness gracious, these things look so awesome. I just really enjoy all of the detail that went into all of the buildings, and of course, Jess's buildings look the same but we'll show them from kind of the back sides so that you can see i mean the detail goes all the way around these miniatures so having all that on top of the game design by emerson Masucci, matt wow i just messed up his name emerson matsuchi um, who, by the way, is an awesome dude. Um, so um, supporting his efforts alone is worth playing this game. Now, we don't start with points. We were, we were. I see how you did that. Because I actually only, I actually put yours up at 13, and you put, I put mine at 5, and I you didn't just, say anything. I didn't, I didn't look. She's already trying to cheat. Yeah. But hey, if you're not cheating, you're not trying. Let's see here. Uh, like the Captain Marbles t-shirt. Yes. Captain Marble. Yeah. Um, yes. I'm, I wonder if that was... What did I walk into? Don't think I'm old enough for this mature content. Okay. What? What? I didn't talk about oh, it might be the hair thing. It is not mature. It's actually very it immature. Very immature, yes. You're I got my finger stuck in my own hair. <laughs> and I couldn't... Look at it, like cut off circulation. I'm telling you, I have issues. Eddie says, if it makes you feel any better, my 33 year old sister asked me about the moon shining. I had to explain the moon doesn't shine, it reflects the sunlight. Blew her mind. <laughs> this is gonna be Dante. 33 years old. No, I think Dante. Dante gets that stuff. He probably gets that because it's science. Yeah. And he's but, a, you know. Asking but the him common the sense stuff, and the fan yeah. He, at the same we were time. playing, we were playing a game the other day. He comes <laughs> up to us, and he's like, "You know what? Just you know what I just realized? <laughs> it's so amazing." And he proceeds to go into this description of, I don't even remember what it was. I don't remember this. It at was all. like, 
Math, 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 oh, math. Oh, it was math. all math. He was like math, doing math, a math. Math, math, math. Something about square roots. Right. I don't know what. That's all you know I remember. You know what's so amazing about square roots? <laughs> yeah, nothing. <laughs> it's math. It's and supposed to be that And he went into more way. of this. And, and we both immediately are like, don't care, dude. It's math. And that was his inclination to begin explaining exactly why <laughs> square roots were so amazing. <laughs> and I think the blood drained out of my face. And he kept going. <laughs> I was like, whatever, dude. And but was, anyway. That was the same day we saw a cup holder that said, I haven't used algebra once today. <laughs> yeah. Another day has passed and I didn't have to use algebra. Not even once. <coughs> Meanwhile, Dante's anyway, happy about anyway, square roots. Yes. Anyway, if it's something math or science, Dante will get it. Yes. If it's common sense related. He might not. He will not until after you explain it to him. All right. About 10 Play a game. Times. Let's go. All right. Uh, so <clears throat> I regret not having back this. You should, Nuno, and I usually don't say that. I regret not backing this because this is an amazing game. JT might not get his copy back. But here's the thing. JT can probably whoop me, so I'm just going to go ahead and give it back to him. He wouldn't, but he could because... Um, well, we will give it back to him. He's a construction worker. He's, he's a man. biker. Yeah. He's bigger than I am, and his beard is better than mine. Nah, I like your beard better. Well, I'm not. Uh, they had some extra copies available for pre-sale. If you're looking to getting a just a little extra, don't tell me this. It needs a Godzilla expansion. Uh, I don't know about. Oh. That. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. Uh, yeah, uh, Foundations of Rome Legacy, where you actually have to <laughs> blow the buildings up. No, that would that would cause me to have a heart attack. This is awesome. Just leave it as is. Uh, they're blue, though. So much superior. Yes. Uh, he's talking about your... Uh, he must I like mean, blue. I mean, clearly. Yeah, but now can't buy anything. Uh, I've been to a local Comic-Con, so no money at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the hair thing. But, but, uh, I, hair, I mean, it was super stuck. Alternatively, Bree says, we also have Foundations of Metropolis coming out. This summer, same game play with cardboard polyominoes instead of plastic minis and a much smaller box. This is cool. This is cooler. I want this. Anyway, uh, fractions rule. Wow. <laughs> what are you, part of a nerd gang? What is that, I don't know. What's your, what's your thing? You say only a quarter of the people. You have some mouth jokey thing. Oh, well, I usually say 83.5% um, of all, 83.5% uh, of all statistics are made up. <laughs> That's what I usually say. And the actual percentage I say changes every single time <laughs> I say it because it doesn't matter. Um, no math, please. Yes. <laughs> uh, does Foundations of Metropolis come with Superman? Mm -hmm. No. But it better have a Daily Planet in there. Bree, get on that. Better be a Daily Planet in, in uh, Foundations of Metropolis. That would be cool. Anyway, all right, we're going to go ahead and get started. So, you might be wondering, and maybe you're not wondering because you've already played this game. <laughs> I don't really care. Um, how do we play this game? Well, basically what we have done, first of all, is we start with... Did you just spit all over the board? What I is, giggled. You did. All right, it might have been me too, though. <laughs> all right, so what we do is we, we are dealt six cards at the beginning of the game, and these six cards uh, denote where we are able to start our little plots of land. So... In this game, we are basically owners of different plots of land within Rome, and we're going to be building up Rome, right? Yes. Um, over the course of the game, we're going to be able to purchase more deeds so that we can expand our properties and the ability to build more buildings uh, and grow larger buildings. One of the rules of the game is that whenever you build a new building in the same place as one of your other ones, it has to be uh, larger than... 
the one that you replaced. So you do want to try to expand out from your other places. Maybe, you know, neither of us have anything down here, so maybe we're gonna wanna start building down there. But those cards are in these three decks, and they're all from the same deck, and they're just split out into three different eras. So you may be wanting you know, D4, but maybe D4 is in era three, so you're not gonna be able to purchase it until then. So those kinds of things are what you're going to be doing. It's gonna play out in a number of rounds. I'm gonna be the first player because Jesse hates going first. Um, and uh, so I'll go first, then she'll go, and then I'll go and so forth and so on. On our turn, we have to choose from three actions. The three actions are um, getting paid, first of all. We get paid by the number of these um, uh, coin-producing buildings. These are, uh, what are they called? They are called... Um... Uh, silver buildings. Yes. <laughs> That's not correct. Uh, anyway, they produce silver. They're, they're like financial buildings. Anyway, uh, you'll get five gold. If you choose to produce income, you'll get five gold plus... However much, uh, I'm sorry, five silver plus however much silver your buildings produce. And that's what you do if you take an income action. If you take a buy a deed action, you're simply going to buy one of the deeds that are out here available for the amount of silver that is shown above it. And you'll add that to your deck, but you'll also put out one of your markers in that area, denoting that now you own that plot of land. So that is uh, income buying a deed, or you can build a building. So when you build a building, you're simply going to take one of the buildings from your um, uh, uh, you know, cod, uh, cache of buildings over here, and you're going to replace however many of your things on the actual board like so. If it has population, then you're going to take population on that. If uh, it has something else, then you're actually going to wait until you take that kind of action to get the benefit of those um, those buildings. Uh, so uh, that's what you can do. But I mean, this was a rather fortuitous opening hand here. Mm -hmm. So I could actually, if I wanted to start immediately with boom, mm -hmm. just like that. But um, that might be a little heavy handed. I don't know, we'll see. But uh, that is it. Now, we will continue going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth until the end of the era. The era will end when you purchase a deed, it's replaced by a card from the deck. When this deck runs out and when all of these cards are gone, that will mark the end of the era. And then we'll go through a little scoring section. After that, we take six cards from the new deck, rebuild the deeds, and... Um, the first player marker will then switch to the other person, and we go through going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth until the second era and third era and all that kind of stuff. The what only difference would be after the last card is drawn. We, we both get one more we turn. We both get one more turn. Yep, one more turn. It's not a thing where you just finish the round. <clears throat> you just simply get, uh, when somebody builds this, everybody gets one more turn after that. And then uh, you can only, on that turn, of course, you can only build a building or take income mm -hmm, because mm -hmm. there won't be any more deeds right. left. Uh, so that is uh, that. All right. We'll go yes. over the scoring uh, when we get there. Um, but generally speaking, you're going to get points for some of these buildings here are going to give you points if they're next to uh, certain other kinds of buildings. Uh, you're going to get uh, points for population uh, and all of your all of our points are going to be tracked right here on on this upper half of that board there. So uh, it's it's pretty pretty simple, but um, it's very satisfying. It's uh, super and fun. I mean that uh, this is only the second time we've played it. Also, so um, we're we're like we played it a couple nights ago. JT brought it over. Uh, what and was we both, it? I don't remember. I don't but remember it must, what day it, it was. Must have been Tuesday. Couldn't have been Wednesday. Couldn't have been Thursday. No. It was it was <laughs> some day this week earlier, and we just had a blast. And and when I found out that JT couldn't be here because of work, I was like, "Can we borrow foundations or wrong? So we can play that again." Uh, so let's see here. Let's just put it this way: if, if JT ever purges this from his collection, maybe we would be the first to buy it. 
Definitely. Board Game Bree says, if you ever bring Dante to a show, she will be happy to talk math with him. Oh, hallelujah. Are yeah. you going to Dice Tower East? He will um, be there. What I heard was free babysitting. <laughs> He's 14. He doesn't need babysitting, but he will talk uh, math. I beg to differ. <laughs> no. I beg to differ. He can take care of himself unless it involves taking a shower while the exhaust fan is on. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, does Foundation... Okay, All right. Okay. she says she's on it, so... Okay. Foundations of Metropolis will have a daily planet. All Hallelujah. right. Hallelujah. So first things first, I'm going to go ahead and buy C4. Cool, cool, cool. Because I want to blow this joint up. <laughs> um, so I'm going to put C4 over here. <clears throat> and the reason I did that is because I do have... Um, a big C3. Block, yeah. So I already have that block there, so I wanted to get something next to it. So they I could slide down. Something. These all slide down, and the new card always goes out here. At the and this is the cost spot. of the card at the top. Yep. All right, your turn, madam. Thank you. I um, would like to buy D6. Have, ha, ha, so bring him free. to the booth and buy him there. That's right. <laughs> yes, I yep. will totally and be like, Bree, Dante, Dante, Bree, math, go. Arcane Wonders. I will. We will do Babysitting. that. Babysitting. I got it. <laughs> no, yeah. math. Session. So I'm buying D6. You're the marketing director. Make that happen, Bree. <laughs> I'm just saying. Math, a math, a math. Okay, so these come down <clears> here. <throat> and then this goes over ham. F7. That's way down there. I don't know. Do I want you to have that though? B6. It's way down there. Really, Strider? Puppy, puppy. Strider's got to be moaning down there. All right. I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to uh, build, I'm going to build a building. I'm going to put this big, I'm going to put this big bank right here um, because I need more Money of these things. Thing here. need more of these thingies. All right, that was me. Cool. I'm actually going to do the same. I'm not copying you, but you had my idea Such first. Such a cheater. And I'm going to buy that and put my thing here. It was right here. I got you. Because mm -hmm. I can always look on my cards. Yep. Which right. makes it very nice for people like me that forget what I'm doing. Hmm. <coughs> A2 is way up there. Um, this is interesting because... Um, no, that's way up there. Time for it. Oh, way there, there we go. <coughs> hmm. I think I'm just going to take income. So I get five bucks plus the two here. Um, but it's also on your board here as well. So if there's ever any. So I get five, and then six, seven. Your turn. I'm going to buy F7 for three. Have a good one, Nuno. Take care. Replace the gap lounge with a math lounge. Oh, yeah, exactly, yes. Right? That should totally happen. No. Actually, no. No math. Uh, patching staging servers. I hope they come back up on reboot. Mm. Oh boy, that sounds interesting. That doesn't sound good. Yeah. What did you do? I bought F7 for three. F7 for three. Okay, there's D7. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to for three, I'm going to buy B6. Um, I'm going to put a building up here. Mm -hmm. Mo money, mo money, mo money. Hmm. I 
make another income turn. Three, uh, it's five plus two, seven. to take income. Okay. So I have five. Six, six seven, seven, eight. Seven, eight. Yep. You want that nice 10, though, there. No, I don't. Lies. Not yet. <laughs> yeah, right? Mm. It's your turn, lady. Shh. Buy one of those things you don't want to make. No, I don't want one of those ones. Then buy it. I will. Buy it. I buy G one. I knew it. I'm gonna buy G two. <laughs> that is straight up jerk level. But do what you gotta do, man. I'll still beat you. <laughs> I still... No, I won't. Wow. <laughs> I will lose. That's what I do. <clears throat> well, you gotta put your thing out there. G one. I. Thank you. I really should buy G two. Right, you should. Just so that I can't build. Mm. You should. No, and, you can still build there. And then I will building. intentionally start buying all those ones that are right next to you. <laughs> Instead of buying to win, I will buy to stop you. There's a difference. Are you playing it's to enjoy one the, the game same. or are you playing to stop the other person? It's one in the same. I'm going to do four bucks. So B7, okay? Oh, see, look, you have your own little empire down there. Leave me and my empire alone. I don't know. If your empire gets too big. Cool. Well, I want G2. See, Jesse probably should have bought G2. She I will did. buy G2. Sam's goal in this game is multiple mani maniacal laugh moments. Yes. <laughs> my Agreed, my, Robert. My finger is actually hurt. Well, whose fault is that, Captain? My hair. Twirly Not hair. My hair. Not mine. Okay, so I'm going to. What do we do now, sir? We die. I'm gonna put my building here for this. Yeah, I knew I should let you do that. All right, so that's get you four. Oh gosh, I just tipped over everything. <gasps> that was what cool. Did you look, do? look, that was so cool. They flipped right back. Oh look, these are gonna make you crazy. Go the wrong way. All right, I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna go with the same. Put that right there. Gives me four as well. Your turn, lady. Thank you, darling. Uh, game looks incredible and plays great, Robert Purdy says. so cool. You are absolutely correct. Uh... 
Look at you and your banks. going to get income. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes. Three, six, I think I'm going to go with uh, income as well, and that's just going to be seven bucks for me. Go ahead. Thank you. Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. I'm going to buy A2 for two. Excellent. Uh, I'm going to go with um, a five for two. Cool. And to answer a possible question, you can only buy one deed card per turn. True. <clears throat> and I'm going to buy B2. For two, I get one back. I think I'm going to go with um, two bucks. Mm. By a four. Just to end the era, eh? Well, you get one more turn and I get one more turn. Right. So go ahead. That's what I'm going to take income. Fine. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. So just take three threes. I am going to. This one and replace this right there for my last turn. All right, so now we come to our scoring round. So end of the first era scoring, commercial building. So players will gain money equal to the values on their buildings on the board. So I get two bucks. For the commercial buildings. These are this ones up here. Uh, bah, 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 bah. No, commercial buildings are the ones that produce silver. So, these are my commercial buildings. I get two bucks. Okay. And I also get three points. Okay. So, I get one, two, three, four. Four. You get those in coins? Did I, did I take... I can't tell if I took... Your last turn? No, 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 no. If I took my two bucks already. I think I did. Please let me know if I took to two bucks twice. I can't remember if I did or not. I don't think okay. I did, but anyway, I have go ahead. Taken. One, two, three, four. Yes. So you get four. And then the next part of that is we gain victory points equal to them. So I get three victory points. And I get three, four, five, six, seven. Jeez, lady. So seven points for commercial buildings. Okay. And now we go to civic buildings. Civic know. buildings are these up here. And so I get one victory point for every uh, population it. that is next to it. So, so that gives me point. four victory points. So I'm up to seven as well. Then uh, we come down to residentials. So I get one, I get a victory point for every population that I have plus 
four because I'm in front. So that gives me 10. And then you get what's in front of you. So you'll get six. So that is seven plus six is 13. Okay. And then that's the end of the scoring round. And we put the first. Yeah, we'll start there. Yeah. I guess it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Like that. And we switch players. And you become first. Cool. So I'm going to take B1 for two points. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Before what? Before what is what I want to know. So you want that one, huh? No. So I should take it just to be snarly nasty like you did with me, huh? I don't want it. I'm just saying. Uh, excuse me? You did give me that one. Excuse me? Mm. I don't actually play nasty. I don't like that. You only took the two silver once. Thank you, Tom. Just thank watch you. it again to make sure. Thank you, thank you. Um, which one of these do I want? Do I want any of those? Hmm. Goodness gracious. Hmm. I'm going to go with three and get B5. Oh, nice. Two. Was that a hay draft? Jesse probably should have brought bought G two. Oh, we already. I was on the past one. Yes, it was a hate draft. He's just trying to be snarly. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'm all about winning. <laughs> yeah, you are. No, I'm not. Let's see. While you mm. are. Look, I'm going to go ahead and show a flyby. Cool. I'm going to buy B3 for four. I'm paying six, so I get two back. And this goes here. And these come down. And this flips over. <gasps> This just kind of gives you an idea. This game of is so cool. The stuff that is still down that you can read. So you can read that it's going to give you two points and I'm sorry, two coins and three points during that scoring round. These are giving you two populations, so you can always double check how much population you have over here on the board just by looking down at your player board here. So it's really cool. Your turn, baby. Oh, my goodness gracious. Cool, 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 cool. I think... Mm, nice. And build that. Go ahead. All right. I'm 
I'm going to pay six. What? For B4. Oh, now that, that, my little filly, was mean. <laughs> no. -uh. Super mean. So you can't build a four here, but I can build something? Yeah. I thought we were talking about. Super mean. Mean winning. I wasn't the gloves to come off. I wasn't off. trying to block you. I was trying to build me. The gloves are off. Oh, you, you tell him I'm coming. Yep. <laughs> All right. You little. Okay. Game has an amazing table presence. Pedro so says cool. you are correct. The drone view, that's correct. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, I'm taking income, so that gets me eight bucks. Go ahead. Matsuchi's game. Yes, that is correct. Emerson is the designer. Okay. Just want to show everyone. I'm going to take A3 for three, honey. I want to show everyone the Serious? face of a meanie. <laughs> Mean. I'm not mean. Super mean. Move the cards down, you meanie. Meanie? I am not mean. Meanie, meanie, pants on fire. That's not, <laughs> it's two different things. So All I right. bought F3. A3, and this goes here. See? That's what mean looks like. Look up mean in the dictionary. You have that illustration to remind Look, you. There's that one there to expand your. Emporium mean. this way. That's right. That's right. Just saying. I was trying to play the game nice. But I'm no. Not, I'm not playing mean. You're going to make me play <laughs> mean. I am not playing mean. Oh, let's see. All right. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm going to do it. See, you're going to get your four anyway. E6. See, you're still going to get your giant block of four. E6. Where? Right there. Oh, no, that's my color. Sorry. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Sorry, Charlie. But I've, but I've got other plans afoot. Hallelujah to you. Just like an Odin's Ravens, right? You all are mistaken. He whooped me. Tom's <laughs> twice, on my side. Twice at at what? Land something land. Sea of land. Lands? Confusing land. Like he slammed me. I think it was like twenty or thirty six to fifteen. Twice in a row. I don't want to hear it. Hate is gone. Hate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, my turn, my love. Yes, yes, go ahead. I'm going to put these people here. <laughs> you fell into my trap. Thank you. I know, it pays you, but... Ten points right there, baby. Yep. What, what? Well, until you decide that you need a three. That's not going to work. What was that? You? Uh -huh. Me? She's Louise. Oh, Melissa. <laughs> She's uh, it's the she owner of Steamers it. West. She goes, wait, game night is tonight? Just kidding. All right. Um, so you did that. Uh, uh, what time do you want? Huh? Um, she says after four, but what time do you want? 4.15, as soon as we can. Okay, I am going to put this little gentleman right here. Nice. Go ahead. It 
So I already built my resplendent library, and now I followed with just a regular library. Well, you this is for the people who are willing to pay more. These are for the plebeians. Mm. Mel's game room. Uh, Mel's board game room. Hello, Melanie. Good to see you. Yay, Foundation's Rome. Such a big box, though. That is correct. Uh, it is a great game for a friend to have. <laughs> yes! That's exactly when it. When he runs out of space, then we'll talk. Yep. Um. Air, land, and sea. What's a game that Jesse normally wins? No, none. Odin's Ravens. I think you've won the majority of the times that we've played. Maybe. Yeah. You rack up the wins on that one. What is another game you've done really well at? Um, I can't remember. There, she, she is a shark. He is a liar. I am not. <laughs> She's a shark. The color of money. She's, she's, uh, Tom Cruise's character in the color of money. Nah. Mm-hmm. We should play this with a chess timer. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you just zip it. JT um, is a good friend to have then. That is he correct. He is a good friend. Even without owning Foundations of Rome, he is a good friend. Mm-hmm. I'm going to buy E1 too. I knew it. What? That is not even mean. I Stop. knew it. Stop. I'm not even mean. <laughs> mean. Um, well, you can't be mean if you get your own finger stuck in your own hair. Mm, yeah, that's just stupid. Sorry. Spend but... two bucks on D2. <clears throat> it's next to my property, so it's not mean. I never said it was mean. Yes, you did. You're the only one that thinks I'm mean. You did. Yo, time, lady. Thank you. It will be out this summer. That's what I hear, Bree. We'll have to keep an eye out for that. Um, Bree was talking, I mean, um, Melanie was talking about how big the box is. And then uh, Bree said... Metropolis. Ma, you know, Metropolis will solve that problem. It'll cool, come out cool, this cool. summer. You know, that kind of thing. What's your favorite board cool, game, cool, Jesse, cool. regardless of wins? I have a top 10 released on Sam's channel. You do. Um, but it's funny because my games are, are based on moments and memories. They're not so much to play. Uh, which is, it's not based on the mechanisms or that kind of thing. It's based, it's based more on, on the experiences that yeah, she had. With them. So it's hard. I have a lot of games that I enjoy. Um, I don't win very much, <laughs> Also Games not you true. like to win. I'm like, nah, I Winston don't know. Winston Hammonds. I just got the metal coins, and they are the only part of this production I don't care for. They aren't as nice as the rest of the game. Oh, I think they're so I, nice. No, I, I disagree with that. I think they are nice, um, and I wouldn't compare them to the rest. They are, I mean, I think they're pretty nice. They're not as good as some other metal coins that are out there, but um, I think, okay, I think they're turn? just fine. Yes. Huh? My yeah. turn. I'm going to go here. Okay. You and the money. Money, 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 money. Money. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, I kind of need to make sure I get that one. So I'm going to pay six for F6. I got to make sure I get that one. True, true, true. Pay 
G7. She said no problem. She can come at 415. Oh, I'm getting, um, I'm going to get uh, income, which gets me eight bucks, I think. Because it's five, mm -hmm. six, mm -hmm. seven, eight. Right. It's all there, five, yeah, yeah, six, yeah. seven, eight. Yep, yep, yep. That's easier for me to count it than this. This is super easy for me to count it. Right. I like that a lot. It's one of my favorite parts because I can easily count it. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see here. Muddle coins are better than cardboard, though. You are correct, Thomas. I am enjoying the clunky sound they make. Yep, that's yeah, what I like yeah. about it too. Cool. Yeah. Hello from Texas. Winston Hammonds is from Texas. Where are you at in Texas, Winston? Let me know. I'm from San Antonio. Um, from Wenatchee so, now. No, I am not. He's from Wenatchee. I live you don't in get Wenatchee. To say that this anymore. is where my home is, but I am from Texas. You can take the boy out of Texas, but you can't <laughs> take Texas out of the boy. Vampire Queen is a game I love that I am amazing at losing at. <laughs> Mel says. <laughs> I, I'm amazing at losing at a lot of games, but I had a great time playing. So. Yeah. There are rarely the games that make me just go, I don't like this game. Yeah. And Those when I do, I'm very grateful that I'm not all, on... Memories are what board games are all about. Yes. Yeah. So my top 10, or my top 50, I don't know, I did a lot. Top, yeah, you did top 50. Are all based on moments and memories mm -hmm. and um, experiences. Yep, yep, yep. Not so much about the significant points of the game <laughs> or how it plays or how I win or how I lose. Just about memories for me. Currently Greenville, but lived in Colleen near Fort Hood. I've spent quite a bit of time in, in San Antonio. My uh, grandparents and my aunt, I think, used to run a uh, like a community center at Fort Hood. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. So we're very, very familiar with that area, Arlington for now, but want to escape. <laughs> So. I use real gold and silver coins, but have to keep resupplying my resources for some reason. Wow. <laughs> Eric. I don't know. Mr. Fancy Pants. Okay, I'm going to build. I'm going to put that there, there. Here? Yeah. Take out that one. Put that one. One, two, three. And does that get me that instantly? No. No. Only at the end when we do Only when you take an income it. action. Mm. I think I'm going to draw the lines. Put those two right there. Your turn. Thank you. I think I'm going to collect income. So okay. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And I'm going to pay three bucks for F3. Where is F3? Right in the center, right? Um, Wait a minute. No, it's right here. Yeah. yeah. F3 is right there. Okay, your turn. Rangers, finally. Rangers, finally. Rangers, Rangers. Yeah, winning at something. <laughs> no, Rangers, finally. I don't know what Rangers, finally means. Matthew, why must you be so cryptic? I have to, but then it's going to 
to give you so many more points, but I have to to keep up. Well, I know it just gives you more points, but keeps me from. Oh wait a minute, losing. we didn't we didn't add that. So, how many population do you have currently right now? Just look on your board. Uh -oh, population. Um, six. Six. All right. So you're up here, and then you just added. Is that including no, that's, this? That's the total population. I that's including that. Yeah. Okay. All right. I don't remember if I've done that. So I've got. Well, you would have I've it. Got four, me. five, six. So yes, I have it. Okay. That was my turn. Okay. I'm going to build my mega bank right here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to buy C6 for two. Okay. So I get one more turn and you get one more turn. tore down my bakery to build some apartments um, and that gives me two four five six seven eight population okay so that was your turn yep. my turn and my turn done. now it's done yep and then it's done yep. um Collect income at the beginning of the round, right, or the end of the round. Well, you get you get whatever things are on your board. Well, so I was debating: should I collect income one more time? Because I don't have, really have anything else to do. That's never a bad thing. It gives right. you more money to begin with, to begin the next era with when okay. these come up. I, okay. I don't. I mean, I if you don't have anything money. else no, no, that you I will need collect to do, money. that's not a bad thing. So either. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <laughs> I feel bad for Ten. you having to take 11 Left. silver at the end of well, the they round. They don't end up being points. So, um, right? Didn't we figure that out? It doesn't translate that, to points. That is correct. The end. All right. So now commercial so, buildings, you get more silver. So you get your silver that you get from all of your buildings. So I only get three. Um, and then you one, get two, three, 11 four, again. Five. No, you don't get the five. No, oh, that's true. Yes, no. you're correct. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. And then you get points for your commercial buildings. So I don't um, have any. I have a lot. So oh, commercial buildings. These are the. No, 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 no. These things up here. The Those ones are you... civic buildings. Oh, you're right. Commercial buildings. I only get five. Um, so I'm up to 22. How many so do you get? I get three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight? So we're at 21. Okay. 21 to 22. Yeah, but you're going <laughs> to. Beat me um, on population shh, here. Be quiet. So um, shh, shh. I told you all I'm gonna lose, but I have a good time. Um, okay, so my two buildings here get me. This gets me one point for every population that it's next to. So that's one, two, eight, twelve. Um, so that is ten, eleven, twelve, and then this one gets me one for every two that it's next to. So that is six, and four is ten. So it gets me five more. That's up to yeah. 39. I told you all I'm going to lose. But I'm um, okay with that. I enjoy myself. And then this one gives me two points for every coin that it's next to. So that is two, four. So that's eight more points there. I gave him all those points. I there just want know. you to know. 
Those were mine. Those were mine. I just give it to him because I'm yeah. nice. <laughs> See? Nice. He shows a mean face on me, and I'm telling well, you, I'm on. actually nice. Yeah. Are you sure you only have six? Because you've got six. This doesn't get four. points. No, but you have population. See, that's oh, the population. Thing. You... I have six, oh, ten, boy. eleven, twelve. I have twelve population. She lied to me during the during the turn because I asked you this. Twelve. Six. It's okay. Ten. It's okay. Eleven. Twelve. It's okay. I'm gonna get you next turn because that was false information. And I thought I was in in the lead, but yeah, you're in the I lead wasn't. on everything. All right, so anyway, you're gonna get 12, 19 points. So that is uh, up to forty, I think. No, it's 10, that's ten, and then nine. Yeah, that's forty. Yeah, you're still ahead. And then, um, so no, we haven't even done population yet. Mm. Uh, well, actually, I'm gonna get. 12 points from that. So that's going to be 10, 11, 12. Okay, but don't I get points for population? You, you did. did. That's how you you got 12 plus I'm 7. Still that's losing. 19. I know. <laughs> just to let you all but know. But you're not losing by as much as you would have been. <laughs> just losing. That's all. Uh, let's see. And I think that's it. We've done all of this residential buildings. All that good stuff. So, C7, See, but all those population C5, points. F5, and it still F2. didn't help me. Well, I, I'm, I have up. more of these buildings out than you do. Yeah, but it still didn't help me, like, points. like, no, like I'm, I'm still not ahead. You need to try to start building some of these that are getting you points off of the other buildings that they're next to. Mm -hmm. that's, the, that's the main difference right now. We would be pretty... I mean, think about it. I got... Um, well, you got 12 points here. I or got, something. I got, and you got 10 eight points here. I yeah. got 10 here and then from this one and then I got uh, five more from this. So I got 15 points mm -hmm. from just these two buildings. Take 15 points away. Mm -hmm. 10, 44. Now I'm only ahead by four points. Mm -hmm. you see what I mean? So it's just one of those things where you're you're getting a lot of points here. I'm getting a lot of points here. So it's the only thing. Oh, and then this one gave me uh, yeah, four like, more points. Yeah, that's what I said. That one. So we would be tied mm. if I if I hadn't built these buildings up here. Um. So yeah. All right. Um. I'm first player this round. Uh, D7, way down there, huh? Hmm. Mm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. What do we need to do same. here? Huh? This is the same as this. Oh, that's a population. Yep. Got it. No, oh, don't we take income at the beginning of the round? No. Oh, that's just at the end. Yeah, you get points. You I, get, mean, I mean, I mean, you don't get need coins. Any. I got like a stack of coins. Yeah, you over got a there. stack of a cheddar over there. I don't want to hear it. Um, so I'm going to spend three bucks on G5. I'm going to spend two on D7. Mm -hmm. And they come down. We're burning through cards here, people. I can't even think that fast. Um, how are we doing on time? Eddie Where's Belfort. Oh, yeah. 
I spell so bad that spell check can't figure out what I'm trying to say. Oh, me too. No baseball. Texas Rangers. It would be the stars for me. Uh, oh, yeah. Eddie Belford. Sorry. Uh. I spend three on C5. I'll spend two. Can you remind me? If you were to buy. What? What? Okay, so you have to replace this with a bigger one. You can't yep. replace it with a two and then replace nope. that with one. It has to be a bigger yep. one. Got yep. it. If you're going to build on these two spots, right. it has to, it has be, to bigger. be bigger. It has to be bigger. I bought E2. So what is my best option here? To explain they get points and I don't think I can do anything. Um, <laughs> is that? Uh, I'm out of coffee. <gasps> Sad, Sad day. face. Sad face. I'm buying C7 for two. That's me one. Okay. Oh, slide him down. And then this is the last card, honey. <laughs> yep. I'm going to take. Um, to take income so it gets me eight bucks because I get five plus that yes your turn three for a one Cool, 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 cool. For two players, did you remove all the H cards? Yes. All the H and then the, the, the blue here, that is all removed. That's for three players. Now, help me. Okay. If I want to place this four mm -hmm. block somewhere, or this four block somewhere. Yes. Okay, so you want to place it here, I imagine? Yeah, so I would place it here, but then so, so, the other ones... So this comes up, uh -huh. and this gets moved here, this gets moved here. And that one goes and away. And this one goes away. Uh -huh. But what is best population or points? Points. Population now. Probably, yes. But do you have anything that's going to make me pay you next to you? <laughs> Well, I don't know. And that puts me up. So I have, I have 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Gosh. All right, so that means I have to make up for that egregiousness. That's going to be 28 points that you get next turn 
at the end of this round. I don't know. Oh my gosh. I don't know. Um, you can put your big block. I realize that. But I'm trying to maximize points, not just uh, hmm. Hmm. Okay, so what do I need to do? Wow. I don't think I can catch you with population now. I think you've gone too far ahead. Even if you did the six? Yeah. Because you'd have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Twelve. 12, 13, 14. 12. Mm -mm. I'd have 14. 13, 14, 15, you're at, you're 16, at 18. 17, 18. Four bucks. I just got game delivered from 114 miles away, went by way of Atlanta, took three <laughs> days and 333 miles. Uh, yeah, that's always funny to me. You're no like, wonder shipping you... is high. <laughs> right, can't you just ship it to me? Um... Yep, and all the okay. eights. So basically the cards have, uh, at the bottom, they have two plus players. Oh, uh, yeah. And then they have three plus, four plus, five plus uh, players, or five players. I don't think it goes higher than five. But all the and there was another side of the board for yep, more players. Yeah, there's also right? another side yeah. of the board. That's correct. Okay, I don't know what to do. Um, I need to like focus on getting points because you're about to end. So, um, um. People or civic buildings. Maybe I will do this. Um, I think I'm going to switch this with these two. That's cool. It gives you one point for every people. So this gets you eight. I get you eight points. Right. That's good. I'm going to take income, which is just eight bucks. Mm. 
Nope, USPS. No wonder. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, it had to go through the FedEx hub in Atlanta, probably. <laughs> nope, USPS. No wonder they're losing money. <laughs> it got. I just, I just remembered why. I just realized what he said. He said it went, he ordered from a place that yeah. was 114 yeah, and it took miles it 331 away. 331 miles. And to it get traveled there. 333 yeah, miles to get there. <laughs> I know. That's what was funny about that. <laughs> That's super funny. All right. Well, it is a military agency. They're not known for their efficiency, efficiency or expediency. Okay. So that gets me. Um, you just took income, so your chances are you want to buy something. So, and you want that one. So I don't want that one. But I will take. F1 for three. And it took three days. I think I did that backwards. I don't know. But I what? I might have taken from here and paid from there, but now I fixed it. That's fine. So that gives me, I'm sorry, F1, which is this one. Yep. I just took D3. Yep. I knew you wanted that. Okay. Um... Other building that doesn't do anything either. Oh, I should have put that block. Okay, so um, That's one per building that's around it. So you're like getting four, one, three. two points right yeah, now. Yeah, I know. But it's it's a positive. Um, I don't think that was really a good I'm going to go this here. Yeah, I'm not chunky thing there. See, now you're going to catch up to me. Well, let's see. That gives me 6, 10, 14. No, it doesn't. Because this goes back, back here, so it only gives me 12. Okay. But you're going to still drop that 6 to bump it up, right? I don't know. I'm going to lose. I'm just trying to prevent the losing. I don't know. I don't know if you're going to lose or not. I'm going to lose. That's a guarantee. That's a guarantee. Um, well, I could place this and it gets me two. I could place this and it gets me two. Mm -hmm. I can place that and it gets me one and a half. <laughs> I can place me that. That is one point. That gives you one point per building. Uh, that's around it. Right. So you, if you put it here, you you've got one, one two, two, three. three. Yeah. One point per building. Uh, this is one point per two population. Mm -hmm. So if you put that and here, that's what I was going to do. I'm going to place this here. That's four points. Yeah, I knew it. Okay, that's cool. I still got some population I can do here. So what does that put you at? Uh, 6, 12, 16, 18. So the same as me. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. Well... These need to go back.
Gives you one more, yeah? Yeah. Count up just to make sure you're at 19. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Yep, okay. Twelve, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen. That was my only chance at winning is getting more population than him. Literally the only chance. Because mm. I don't have enough points on the upper part. We'll see. So I will pay two to take a seven. Tell we're thinking we've stopped talking. Yeah, it's true. It does get a little thinky at the end. No, it doesn't. I'm going to lose. There's no <laughs> thinking once true. you get past that point that you realize Three, you're just going to lose. Four. You don't have to get caught up in the thinking. You just go, ah, I'm going to lose. Um, what is it he said? Boy, I wish this game had a chess timer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. On a funny subject, yeah. when my parents were visiting last week, Sam was making like the breakfast essentials. My dad said, I think that's more in than an, 85 in, in DBA. Ninja, in a, yeah, in ninja, ninja blender. blender. Bzz, bzz. That is more than 85 DBA. Yeah. And then later that night, Sam turned to my dad and goes, That is more than 85 DBA. Something else was going on. <laughs> Uh, what am I going to do? I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know. I could... Mm. could mm, that won't do me any good, really. I could see him. One, two... That one is three. coin next to coin, right? Not really. There's only three. Yeah, but that's, that's three points. Um, I could put this out there and get four points. Mm. So, really, that's what I think I need to do. Um, no. We know he's going to win. That's my last turn. Okay, then that's my last turn, too. I'm doing the same. So, we both have 20, right? Yep, so that means Six, he just doesn't 12, beat me by 1,000. He beats me by 62. 16, 18, 20. You have 20 as well? Probably. 6, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, okay. Uh, it just means it's, it's, we both get 30 points. Basically. Right, but it just means he doesn't beat me on that. But he's going to beat me on everything else, so, so I'm not worried. Um, empty lots. Do you have any empty lots? Nope, we have used there them all. No empty lots. Okay. All right, so no empty lots, so we don't get victory points for empty lots. Basically, you just get one right, per point square. per empty lot. Yeah. Uh, then we do commercial buildings, so we get uh, victory points equal to the value Election. of the... Oh, wait, we get players equal to the value of the things. So right. basically, you just get this and right. this for victory points. So I'm going to get eight points. Wait, you get that plus that? Yeah, because oh. you get this as victory points, oh. and then you also get that. I get five, six, One, seven, two, eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You only got eight? Yes. Because I covered up my banks to make population so you wouldn't beat me at two, population and beat me oh, by 60 points. Oh, okay. Eight. All right. 
Uh, he's going to win, you guys. You don't even need to tally the score. Stop. <laughs> Stop. And he it's made a big deal about true. showing my mean face. I'd like to show you Sam's mean oh, face. I after don't he have wins. a mean face. After he wins, I mean have face. a perpetual mean face. <laughs> no, you don't. Uh, everybody okay, says so we did I'm that. mean. You're not mean. Um, so we did all of this. Now we do our civic buildings. So this is where I think I get 15 points. This one gives me. Yeah, I don't oh, have no, anything no, no, that gives no, no, no. me 15 I get points. Six, 10 plus two more here so this one gives me 12 and then this one gives me five more so that's 17 that's 17 points so that um, to 80 yeah you guys he's gonna literally lap me pretty soon that is not true <clears throat> and then uh, i get my civic points can you help me your, add yeah, that your civic you don't get well that. i i <laughs> I don't think I get any more civic points. I think these mm -hmm. are the only two civic buildings yeah. that I have out there. You have this one, honey. That's oh, clean. okay. So that's, yeah, but it's significantly less. It's two for two, and you took away your your big your other big building. So I get four points from that. So up to eighty-eight, and then you yeah, he's up to eighty-eight. You and I'm have at 30. this he one, is. which gets you one, two, two three. three, and then you have this one. Which gets you uh, 12 more, no, 13 more, 12, 13, one point per thing, so that's 13 more. So 13 plus 14, 15, 16. I have another one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Or that one. Oh, this one. Um, one per For two. For every two, so I get four points. That's eight. Four more. Sixty-eight. Okay, and then uh, residential buildings. So we both get thirty. Um, yeah. So we're so tied. One. I, I, he wins by thirty points. Two, three. Yeah. And you I get, get one, one, two, three. two three. Yeah. He beat me by thirty points. Um, that. What a shocker. Players with at least. Uh, position of their first place. Yeah. Because <clears throat> ties are friendly. Yeah. The thing is, is he says I'm a shark. He's such a he liar. Is a sh you are a shark. Lies. Okay, I I'm lose way here. more than I win. So I, if It would help if I could get points for the coins. That might help me a little, but it still wouldn't <laughs> be enough. <laughs> you You stopped playing... I was saying mean earlier, but you stopped playing to win when I made a big deal out of it, and you shouldn't. Yeah, because you mean told everybody I was mean, so I'm like, well, I'm not gonna play that like that anymore. <laughs> I was joking. I'm not gonna play you like that. You come well. Me mean. I'm not you gonna play. Come, uh -uh. Stop. You were playing well, and you stopped right here. Yeah, because you told me I was mean. Stop it. You knew I was joking around. <laughs> I do know you're joking around. But. Um, because there were many times where you could have you could have sniped some of these things where you could have sniped this spot, you could have sniped this spot, and that would have kept me from getting the equal population up here. Mm -hmm. So you stop doing that. Stop being nice, mean well, lady. You told me I was mean. I'm not going to be mean. Anyway, this is what the game looks like. Yeah, show them that. At the end. Do you need that? Here. So, let me go ahead and show. This is such a cool game, you guys. So this is the player board after it's done. Has all of the information clearly marked on it, so you can score really easily. But the cool thing is, is this is what the game board looks like after it's you've so got cool. everything built up. It's so freaking neat. It's so cool. I'm trying to be as steady as possible, but... Well, don't ask me to do it because I won't be. Just a really great looking game. Great looking game. It's so cool. Indeed. So, was not cool that JT couldn't be here, but. Um, Sorry, JT, we missed you. Very happy to have been able to. Well, put that down. Yeah, there we go. To have been able to play this. Otherwise, because Super cool. this is a great game. Um, and it's a super fun game as well. Um, it's one of those games where it's not hard to play. It is not hard. So that it lets you just enjoy everything about the game. Yeah. 
when I first saw the game, I went, oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. But it don't, you only have three actions. Yeah, it was easy. It's it was not like bad. you're going to have to choose this or that. No, here you go. Um, and just get kind of, you know. Everything got bought and everything got built. That's pretty cool. That is cool. There were no empty spots. But that's another cool thing about the game as well is that you get... You get at least one point. Yeah, you get at least one spot. point for those empty spots if you can't use them. But that was fun. That was really cool. We really enjoyed that one. Sam built a better Rome. Sam using PSYOPs. Psychology. Yeah, I don't play psychology games. I suck <laughs> at that. <laughs> I suck at that. <laughs> Uh, if it's not dial placement, I can't figure it out. You know. Somebody from, it looks like Japan said hello. Uh, I can't read your name. Otherwise, I would go. No, that's maybe not Japan. I don't know. Uh, why do you have Katy Perry on the mind, Sam? Katy Perry? And you were singing something. What? I don't know. Something. At some point, you were like, no, that's not Katy Perry, but no, that's I, I don't know what you were. Guardians of the Galaxy. You were humming something, but maybe they no, interpreted no your humming as Katy Perry. Much like Return to a Return to Dark Tower, a hefty price, but an amazing table presence. It's so cool. Jesse, go for the kill. I go for the person at the net in my other hobby. Uh, tennis. Ooh, I hit the ball nice. hard. I say I'm sorry, but I never mean it. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> uh, which way did you enjoy more, at two or a higher player count? I enjoyed both I they normally. Were both fun. Uh, the experience that you have from the game uh, is the same. Having that extra column and row for a three player game uh, makes. I think it evens the game out pretty well. It didn't feel any tighter this time, and it should have felt more loose but i really didn't feel like it was more loose either because you don't have that third player grabbing for points so it, that sh grabbing for other stuff so it should feel like more loose but it doesn't because they take that extra column and that extra row out um so i think scaling it down and scaling it up works in the in the manner of speaking that it the experience that you have for the game isn't lessened by having fewer people. I think it's great that way, though. I'm so prepared. I really think it's great that way. Um, I think, however, um, as long as you are not completely ignoring population, 20 points over the course of the game, or 21 points over the course of the game actually, isn't that huge of, an, of a difference. If I hadn't played Population, I would have. you would have beaten me by 80. <laughs> no, but what I'm saying is that you would, have st you would have gotten all but 10 points on that last round mm -hmm. if you would have been one point behind me. You would have gotten all but 10 points. So knowing that I couldn't beat you on Population, I should have just built different buildings maybe but just give up at that point and be like i already have six points on population well, and take well, everything i was out. i was thinking about doing that when you jumped up to 18 and i was right. still at like nine right i was thinking about how can i because i knew i was still going to get your 18 points right i knew i was still going to get your 18 points so i wasn't necessarily i would wanted to see if i could counteract mm -hmm. the 10 and the seven Mm -hmm. I wanted to see if I could counteract the 17 points that I was going to be missing mm. because I knew I was going to be getting your base population of points. But um, I couldn't figure it out because math. So I just tried to beat you on population or at least just equal you because you have friendly ties. Mm. Um, the more players, the less likely to get larger property groupings and less of the larger buildings get built mm. truth mm -hmm. yeah that is true um because you have a third player putting stuff in mm -hmm. there mm -hmm. but um mm. but it's still fun still really fun 
I don't know that I, I prefer one experience over another. It was fun. I want to play with four players now, but we'll have to wait. So I'm not taking it tonight because JT's not going to be there. Right. I don't want this to get messed up. Oh gosh, no. It'll be on my it'll be on my watch, and I'm not having that happen. Uh, Al Hernandez, the game looks great at the end. Uh, it's yes, so cool. but is that the Kickstarter edition, or will the regular base game look just as good? Uh, the 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 Metropolis game that they have out, Foundations of Metropolis, is going to be cardboard uh, polyominals. It's not going to be miniatures. So, if you want the miniatures, you're going to have to try to uh, find a copy of this game. This is the Kickstarter edition. Uh, the the regular retail base game is going to be the smaller um, cardboard polyominals. Of this game or Metropolis? Foundations of Metropolis is this game mm. without the miniatures. Mm, mm, mm. It's just going to have cardboard polyominal cutouts mm -hmm. that you'll place on the board, and mm -hmm. it won't. It'll just be two dimensional. It won't be three dimensional. So, yeah, this is the Kickstarter version. That this is, is so cool. All righty. Um, I'm sure we have to go. Yep, oh, we gosh. do. We got to get, well, we got to just, we got to get ready. We start getting ready to go. We do We're have good. to get packed up. We have to get our, our uh, table game table packed up and load up the truck. Uh, so everything, so we, for our time That also our involves time unloading tonight. the cars first. <laughs> really? What's in the car? All the chairs and the <laughs> so it's it's like Boo. a multi-step thing. It's unload all Boo. the stuff that we have to take to football practice and football games, then put all the stuff in there that we need to take for game night. Boo hiss. But flatbread pizzas. So I'm flatbread excited about that. Is correct. All right, we're gonna get out of here. Have a great uh, Friday evening. If you're in the area, come on by Steamers West. Yes, if please. not. Um, you will be missed. Yes. And we'll we have see a live you tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m. Pacific time, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time or Eastern Time, whatever you. So we'll see you tomorrow morning if we don't see you tonight. Take care. And we'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Bye. Bye bye. Oh, puppy.